Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to solve the 10th question from CBSC class 10, 2023-24 practice questions for mathematics standard with subject code 041, section A, which is multiple choice questions for one mark each. Now this question is from the introduction to trigonometry chapter. Shown below is a table with values of cosecant and secant of different angles. What are the values of P and Q respectively? Now let us understand the table first. What is the meaning of this? Now theta represents the angles 35 and 65 degrees respectively. And if we take cosec of 35 degrees then we get P. Cosec of 65 degrees is 1.1. Seek of 90 degree minus, if we take theta as 35, we get the value as 1.7. And seek of 90 degree minus, if we take theta as 65, we get the value as Q. Let me write down all the values right now. So this is what it represents. Cosec 35 is P, cosec 65 is 1.1. Seek 90 minus 35, we get 1.7. And seek of 90 minus 65, we get it as Q. Now, we need to know a relationship between the cosecant and the secant. And the relationship is called as the complementary trigonometric ratios. Let me write here. So here you can see, this is the relationship between the cosecant and the secant. Here, cosec of 90 minus A, A is an angle, will be equal to the secant A. Or secant of 90 minus angle A will be equal to cosec of A. Now in the given table, we have the second relationship that is secant of 90 minus theta. So we are going to consider the second relationship and find out the values of P and Q. Now if you look at this relationship, it resembles the third and the fourth values of the table. That is seek of 90 minus 35 and seek of 90 minus 65. So let us consider the first one that is seek of 90 minus 35 and put it over here. So here let us write as seek of 90 minus taking the first value 90 minus 35. So this should be equal to actually cosec of 35 from the complementary trigonometric angles, so cosec of 35. So since we know that sec of 90 minus 35 is 1.7, we will just substitute here in its place. So this will be equal to cosec of 35. So let us see if that is the value we had to find. So cosec of 35 was P. So we got the value of P as now 1.7. Similarly, we are going to use this fourth value now and use this complementary trigonometric angles formula. So now we take seek of 90 minus 65. So that is going to be equal to cosec of 65. Now, we do not know the value of seek 90 minus 65, but we know the value of cosec 65, which is 1.1. So here we can just write seek of 90 minus 65 is equal to cosec of 65. The value was given as 1.1. So this is 1.1, which was your Q value. So we got the P value as 1.7 and we got the Q value as 1.1. So here our answer is going to be P value is 1.7 and Q value is 1.1. This is our option C. So to solve this question, we made use of the complementary trigonometric angles and formed a relationship between the secant and the cosecant angles to find the missing values. I hope you have understood all the steps and liked the video. If you are liking my videos, like, share and subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching.